Hello everyone, welcome to a very bright and colorful Friday new product post. We've got a few demos for you, so let's dive right in and see what we've got for this week. So first up, we've got these LED string lights. They come in this um, 10 meter coil, and there are 100 total lights on there, so light every 10 centimeters or every 4 inches or whatever. We've got these two strands. They're insulated with like a um, epoxy or something like that. Um, and we've got these little LEDs every 4 inches that are um, just like an SMD LED covered in epoxy. Um, all we did for this is just take a lighter and just kind of burn off a little bit of that coating and so we could attach it to the alligator clips. Now, we have them in all these different colors. The manufacturer does claim that they are not waterproof, but I've got 10 of them here submerged in water and they seem to be doing okay. This is not the first take. Um, because these leads are actually insulated, we found that they are pretty well waterproofed. Try this at your own risk. We do not recommend you try this at home. So here are all the colors that we have. Um, this first one is a pink. Um, we've got this one, which is an RGB that cycles. Um, we've got this nice bright green. We've got this one, which is purple. Um, this one is the red. Um, we've got this one, which is a warm white. We've got a blue, we've got a yellow, we've got a cool white, and then we have an orange. These are powered with 12 volts. We've got them sitting on nine volt batteries right now. So you can run them off nine volts, but they are designed to be worked with 12 volts. So if we had 12 volts, they'd go a little brighter. Um, we tried that and our power supply had a little bit of an issue, so it died. So here is the LilyPad MP3. The LilyPad MP3 is a combination between a LilyPad board an MP3 player shield, and a stereo amplifier all in one board. We've got an SD card socket, we've got a headphone jack, we've got all sorts of other stuff on there, runs off of a battery, and here we've got the makings of a little demo that we're going to do with this. Um, so we've got the battery connected into it, we've got some alligator clips, and we've got these um, thin speakers that we sell. As you can maybe see, the little knob here is red. The knob comes separately, by the way. This is the illuminated rotary encoder that we sell. And um, if we press it, it will start playing. Now, that's a little bit too quiet, so I'm going to hold this down for a second. This turns green, and all I have to do is turn it up. And if I hold this down again, I can change tracks. And then one little click, we'll pause it again. So this is um, just the kind of uh, basic code that comes on it when you get it. So what we decided to do is take this little setup as is and connect it into a SparkFun hoodie and make Nick's quiet, happy place for him. So here we are with Nick, and I'm going to be presenting him with the new LilyPad hoodie. So Nick, this hoodie is, is really cool because it has a LilyPad built into it. So you can press this button to play music. So when you're talking to someone that you don't want to talk to, you can just put up the hoodie and it has speakers built into it. Isn't that great? So you don't have to pay attention to people when they're talking to you. There you go. Yeah, you just, yeah grab it. Great. He's going to love it. Hey, Nick. Uh, you remember the ad we did for the front page for ABC? Uh, I need you to make one for the Learn homepage uh, for, the, uh, for the tour. So uh, if you could get that back to me just end of the week, something. That'd be, that'd be great. Okay. Hey Nick, so good to see you, man. Hey, you know I just got back from that trip with Rob, right? We went to Chernobyl, it was amazing. I took like a thousand photos. I was wondering if you wanted to see some because I know you're pretty much into photography yourself. So I was into photography and I took some photos there and it was amazing, holy crap. And it was just like, I want to show you. Are you even, I guess, not even. And lastly, we've got a really interesting new screen from 4D Systems. This is the UT OLED 20 G2, and it is a transparent OLED, and it's a 2-inch transparent OLED. Um, it's very similar to all their other products. It has a micro SD card socket on it, and you can you know, load programs directly on it and all that good stuff. We just got this the other day, so we haven't had time to do a proper demo, but we are working on one, so check back in the next week or so. Here we've got some power applied and it's just running through like its little basic screen that it um, shows when it turns on. As you can see, it is fully transparent. 
ready for your development and prototyping pleasure. So there you have it. This is your Friday new product post. Hopefully you like the demos and um, await the upcoming demo on the transparent OLED. We'll have a little bit more on that um, in the next coming weeks. And of course, we have more new products on the website. So check out the rest of the new product post. And we'll see you again next week with even more new products and more demos. See you then.